zombie cat. This is Mr. E.F.G. And this is our review of the new Gremlins Mohawk Gremlin. By NECA? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I thought so. This is the second the second version of this form of the Mohawk Gremlin. Like, not counting the video game. They released this before, and it wasn't as nice as some of the later Gremlins they made from Gremlins 2, so it's cool that they updated them. And they showed this off a long time ago, and they finally just released it. I was starting to think it was never going to happen. Yeah, me too. <laughs> but when they came out with the video game one, which is basically just this one, but painted differently, I was thinking, well, they're probably going to release it eventually, because all they'd have to do is repaint it. And they did. But there's the picture, and on the back... The only other thing they show is the ultimate gizmo, which isn't a good sign. I wish they would make some more gremlins. I know. They could make some up and I'd probably still buy them. Yeah. <laughs> well, let's open this up. Here he is all opened up. And he looks pretty fucking awesome. Yep, I'm really happy with him. He's pretty cool. He is really detailed with that paint job. This is one of my favorite gremlins, and I was always kind of disappointed with the old one, so it's really cool that we got a new version. Yeah. And yeah. we'll compare them later, but the, the amount of detail is just indescribably better. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Ever since they came out with the spider gremlin and how well they painted it, I always thought, man, they need to remake him. And they did, and it looks amazing. Yeah, they did a really good job. I'm very pleased. So there's a close-up of his face. And you can see there's a lot of detail in that skin. It's like even just the sculpt. The sculpt is crazy. I mean they even did like detail and shading inside of his mouth. Yeah. That's pretty awesome. That's impressive. And I like you can see his teeth because on... I forget which version it was. Was it the video game version? I forget. One of the versions. He's not. But yeah, he's kind of sloppy on the teeth. It's hard to see the teeth, but in him you can see them. They're, they're on there, you can see the sculpt, see the paint. It looks pretty good. Look at them crazy ears. And all that, all them different colors they used. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of different colors on this guy. He's definitely the most colorful gremlin we have. <laughs> well, spider gremlin might be more. <laughs> well, he has more surface area to cover, so. I think he has about the same amount of colors. Look at all that on the back. That's just crazy. That's a really awesome Gremlins. And it kind of sucks when you see see it in the store. You can only see it from the front. I mean, you can kind of like peek down through the sides, but I mean, you miss all this if you can't see the see the whole thing. They almost should have had it just like a clear package, but I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> that probably wouldn't be a good idea. But. There's just so much awesome detail in this, especially in the back area. And I really like his fin on this one too, his his actual mohawk is pretty yeah, cool. Yeah, it is pretty awesome. Well, we should compare him to the old one because that's like one of the main yeah. things. <laughs> Alright, so there they are together. It Ooh. is really hard to believe that this is supposed to be the same creature. Yeah. <laughs> they do not look the same at all. Well, a little bit, but I mean, they do look like they're supposed to be different characters almost. Well, they look like the same species. Yeah. That's about it. But two different ones. <laughs> two very different ones. I mean, there's just so much more detail in the paint on this one. It's ridiculous. It's so much more colorful. It's got the spots on there way better. I mean, um, he hard the old one hardly has any spots at all. Yeah. And he looks like he was airbrushed by somebody who just didn't give a shit. Yeah. <laughs> they were just like, yeah, that looks good enough, whatever. Like you said, it looks like somebody had Cheetos on their fingers and rubbed them around right there. And Especially all down his arms. Yeah. It looks like he rolled around in a bag of Cheetos. <laughs> mm -hmm. And like you're saying, the fin. Yeah, the fin on the new one looks so cool. This one's kind of sloppy up here. It looks so... It, I don't know, it just... It looks a little odd on this one. Yeah. There's not enough red on it either. And I like how this one's all glossy too. Mm-hmm. Um, 
some of the sculpt I think is the same. Like I think, I think it's no wait, it's a the different torso is not the same. No, I thought it was at first, but it's a different torso. I yeah. think the ears might be the same. Mm. I don't know. I think that I don't know, it's hard to tell. It's hard to tell because they're painted so differently. Yeah, but uh, the legs are different. I mean, some of the differences are obvious because of the. There's more articulation though, and we'll go over that in a little bit. But yeah, it's. I, I the don't upper know. arms look the same. Yeah, they could. But just, it's hard to tell because they also have different articulation. Yeah. But well, that's another thing on the old one. His spikes are just the same color as the rest of his arm. Yeah. Well, look like you see how much more color is in this new one and what did, what the hell did they do with the ears on this I, just, I don't know man <laughs> just like drew like little lines on it. I told you whoever painted them was just like I don't give a shit <laughs> I'm getting paid whether this looks like ass or not did whatever they, not, they not have good reference photos or maybe they only got paid like 50 cents an hour and they're just like fuck this toy <laughs> <laughs> and another cool thing like, I, we were talking about articulation, but I want to go over this now, I guess, because his mouth can't open. It's just stuck in that expression. But this one could open. I mean, you can't get that expression because the lips are closed. But still, you can open and close the mouth, which is pretty awesome. I'd much rather have the opening mouth. Yeah, me too. That, that is really cool. And I like his angry expression. Mm-hmm. This one looks like he's grinning. I think he looks smug. Yeah. <laughs> Well, might as well go over articulation now. Yep. I think the ears are the same. I don't know. Maybe not. Well, I thought they... Well, no, I guess the ears don't move. I thought they can move. The Mogwais can move. I guess the Gremlins don't. But, like we just said, this one has an opening jaw. This one doesn't. Then at the head, it's probably the same. Well, maybe not. Nope, this has extra articulation. You can see there's double it's, joint in there. Yeah. It's like a double ball joint, sort of. I don't know what you call that. Yeah, so yeah, this is really good. Yeah. This one can. What can this one do? They could just spin. spin. That's all it can do is spin. The, the old one's articulation really sucks. Mm hmm. Whoops. <laughs> yeah, this one all over the damn place. That was mm -hmm. awesome. Let's see what the shoulders are like. I think the shoulders are the same. Uh, no, they're not. Well, they're diff they did it the a different way. You can see that has that little peg in there. And this one has like the, the hinge up there. Well, the articulation looks a little different because the, you can see that peg there. But the articulation of the shoulder is about the same. It can go it out. It the same amount, yeah. You can go about that far and then it can go straight up. So it, don't, yeah, it doesn't seem like there's anything really different at the shoulder. But then at the elbow, there you can spin here. And you have the hinge joint. His only spins. That's it. <laughs> as as with the wrist, it just spins. And his wrist can spin, but also there's a hinge. So you can go like that. And that's pretty cool. Then neither of them have anything at the torso. Then you get down to the hips. And these can go out to the side a little bit. They can kick forward. What can that one do? This one can spin like this. And that's it. He doesn't even have a knee or ankle joint. It's just spinning. That's yeah. all. That's that's all his legs can do. Yeah. But this one has, like she said, the knee. And then also down at the ankle, which is a ball joint. So, yep, articulation is way better on this new one than compared to this one. And I also always hated the way the old one's hands were shaped. Oh yeah, they're kind of boring, but this one's... Yeah, these are nice. Well, you can basically only pose him with his arms hanging down or sticking out, and he just looks like he's gonna give you a hug. Yeah. Now this one also comes with the uh, machine gun. So that's pretty cool. The uh, video game version also came with this. But, uh... That's pretty cool. He comes with the machine gun. That's also probably some of the reason they gave him these particular hands is so he could 
hold them with a machine gun. That's pretty cool. I guess we can compare them to the video game. Because this is why I figured they would eventually, finally release this one. Is because, you know, they released the video game one, which has this updated sculpt. He's but, on a little stand, because he likes to fall down. <laughs> yeah. And I, I think it's just the exact same sculpt. It should have all the yeah. same articulation that, that this one does. And it's still not quite as cool, just because the paint isn't as detailed, but it's not yeah. as detailed for a reason. <laughs> His fin's also a little bit bent up. Yeah. But that's cool seeing him both. Oh wait, I'm never talking about the machine gun. It's all painted crazy there. Here he is next to one of the the older gremlins, but after the original Mohawk when they started doing better articulation. So this one's a little bit closer to the quality, but he's still way cooler. Yeah. Uh, he's got pretty much the same articulation. And is that the same torso? No, different torso. Because this one's all wrinkly looking. But yeah, this one's still pretty cool. This is one of my favorite sculpts too. Yeah, and it's just like Mr. Regular Gremlin. Because <laughs> most of the ones I have, it's like the Brain Gremlin and the Phantom and the yeah. Flasher. And <laughs> we don't have any of NECA's Gremlins from the, the first movie though. Because they I they just weren't as nice. Because that was even before I think the first Mohawk mm -hmm. from Gremlins Two. So I wish they would remake the Gremlins One Gremlins again because that would be cool. Yeah, really good Spike. Yeah, Stripe. Stripe. I always want to call him Spike. And here is the Spider Gremlin, which he turns into later in the movie. Which is still one of my favorite things that we own in general. Yeah, it is. <laughs> It is such an amazing figure, and you can see the detail. When this one came out, I looked back at the original, the original Mohawk. It's like, why didn't he paint him as nice as this? Mm -hmm. But now we got one that's just pretty much painted the same. That, that's pretty awesome. There's so much detail on this guy. Ridiculous. One thing that I noticed right away is that. His fin looks way better. I wish Spider Gremlin's fin looked that good. Yeah, well, that's a I mean, it better. still looks nice, but that, I think that one looks better. Yeah. I do think this one has a little more detail in the paint, like in the face and stuff. Mm -hmm. Like if you look closely at the face, there's more going on, I think. Like more varying colors and... More dots. Yeah. It's not a whole lot different. But still, just a tiny bit. And there's all three versions of Mohawk from Gremlins 2. We got his Mogwai version down there, then his Gremlin version, then his Spider Gremlin version. So that's pretty cool. They all look really awesome. This is probably one of my favorite Mogwais, too. Yep, him. And this one are my favorite Mogwai toys. Sad gizmo. I just, his face is so fucking cute. And you just put him next to any of the gremlins. And look, he's like, <laughs> yeah. why are you being mean? <laughs> <laughs> well, actually, a better one than this one would be the ultimate gizmo. Because you can, you, you get this face as one of the faces. Yeah. We just, this is just the regular original sad gizmo because ultimate versions over somewhere. <laughs> he just looks like the world's being mean to him. Mm. <laughs> There's Mavok picking on poor Gizmo. He's so sad about it. Mm. <laughs> so overall, I would say this is a pretty fucking awesome toy. It's definitely one of my new favorites. Yeah, he's really well done. He's very impressive. And it's a long time for this guy to come out. They've been showing him for so long, like I said. I do wish they would release the other ones they previewed a long time ago. There's a few, like the... There's one with the Warner Brothers logo and then a melting gremlin. And they look really cool and I wish they'd make them. A lot of people want the female one, which... I mean, I think they should make the female one. I just don't think either of us really care about that one as much. Cause it's I mean, I probably want her just for my collection, but she was one of my least favorite Oh, well, I assume things. you wouldn't because you didn't want Lenny or, uh, what's his name? They're not that memorable, though. 
Like, she's definitely memorable, even though I didn't really like her that much. Yeah, they were. The crazy one was very memorable. Well, yeah. What the hell is his name? Lenny's the dopey looking Daffy? one. Daffy? Daffy, yes. Daffy's the crazy one. We never got him either. I, I, thought... I have the Mogwai. I don't have the Gremlin. Yeah. But, oh, there's also the vegetable one, too. Vegetable Gremlin. <laughs> I don't want that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yep, I think he's amazing. Articulation, the paint, the sculpt, everything's better on this guy. Well, this is Mr. Cheese. And I'm Zombie Cat. Thanks for watching. Goodbye. Gizmo. Hey. <laughs> Give me that. <laughs> now get your little green goblin looking ass out of here. Oh, damn it, man! You see them other pictures there? Why don't you click on one of them to see the video? Or you could subscribe and eat. Oh!